So let me, let me I, I didn't, I, even, I didn't think even think about it, but I was just thinking like uh, drink champs, quick time with slime. I don't got, it ain't never quick, but mm-hmm. I'm gonna do a little quick time. So um, heels or sneakers? Sneakers. Sneakers. People that really know me, sneakers. I know she's the queen of Jordans. Yeah. Um, and Yeezys. Um, <laughs> sweats or dress. Um. That's a tough that's one. A, that's a, ah, I got you it. You know, see, like, when I'm at home, I, look, I, yeah. I could live in my Adidas mm-hmm. slides, mm-hmm. my sweatpants, and just my t-shirts. Yeah. I'm good like that, you know? That's what's up. I'm good like that. That's more comfortable for me. Okay. Mm-hmm. Speaking of Adidas, this is Adidas. Y'all check out the say to go get it at And okay. embroidery. So I know you know about your, your textures and fabrics yes. and everything like that. I know, um, I, I know something. Yeah. <laughs> I know a little um, bit of something. Okay, so yeah, definitely comfortable. Because I remember you just wearing a lot of um, J's and stuff. And, in high um, school, right? And maybe, even, I felt like you used to wear Tim's too, right? I Probably yeah. like a couple <laughs> Back times, in the day, right? yeah. A couple of times, yeah. 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 Yep. Um, so as far as, um, I guess, like on your leisure time, mm-hmm. do you... Do you party? Do you smoke, drink? Like what? Like what? What are what okay. things do you like to do? So here's the thing about me: I I do not smoke at all. I don't drink. I yeah. don't drink. Um, it's just I used I tried it like maybe like once or twice, mm-hmm. and I just think liquor is just so nasty. It's just yeah. the taste of it. I just can't do it. Yeah, but that's good. And then like I feel like yeah. it helps me out as I get older because mm-hmm. I've seen some of my friends or yeah. some people that I've known back then. And like you know, like alcohol it does something to you. It changes you in a way. So. The room looks different, right? It, right, when, right. When yeah. they're all buzz and you I like to like be yourself. alert and aware mm-hmm. yeah. <laughs> at all times. Yeah. So yeah, that's I'm not a big drinker, or smoker, none of that. Um, I'm very like um, yeah. like a health freak. You know, yeah. I drink tons of water. Yeah. Like I eat salad a lot. I work yeah. out. I barely even eat meat. Really? Yeah. How about seafood? Um, seafood, yes. That's like, I, th- I feel like if I had to cut anything out, I'd like, just give me some seafood. Give me some shrimp. Really? Give me some crab. Yeah, I love seafood. <laughs> I love know, pasta. I like sushi, stuff like that. But like, I'm not yeah. big on like red meat. Oh, okay. Now I can dig it, you know, yeah. um, especially being, you know, a health fanatic and everything like that. Yeah. So when it comes to food, you know, now that I have a three-year-old daughter, I'm just right. realizing we never break out of that mode from once we go from the mush to eating food. Eating is just a part of life that we all love, no matter if mm-hmm. you eat just vegetables, right. but like good food and cu- cuisine is like, to me, like I'm a, I would consider myself a foodie. Yeah, and I know yeah. like you like to, I feel like it's part of of culture, like, you know, dressing nice, having mm-hmm. good fun, traveling and stuff like that. So where, where are your favorite places to eat? And like, what are your favorite places to vacation and eat? Like, because it looks like you kind of, you have you have a balance of you know um, what you want to show the people and at the same time you know just your, your your style of life you know oh yeah definitely like I'm you know like Instagram is cool and mm-hmm. everything you know it, it's yeah. helped me you know get Navigate. more exposure yeah, and you sure. know get myself out there more but like all yeah. in all I'm a pretty private person you mm-hmm. know I kind of only show what I mm-hmm. want to you right. know what I mean like I don't put yeah. my whole life out there right um, so as far as like that I mean traveling and food go hand in hand. So exactly. I love to travel and I love to eat different foods, different mm-hmm. places. Um, but as far as like favorite places to eat, um, I guess my first time as ever visiting um, California, I went to Los Angeles like two right. or three years ago with a friend mm-hmm. and we went to In-N-Out. Oh, very You've heard slack. of that? Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> and people, people from there probably don't eat it. It's like McDonald's. It, right, to them, yeah, but to me, it was like yeah. the best thing ever. So yeah. I really like that place. Um, there was a few other restaurants. I wish I could remember the name. Mm-hmm. But it, some of the best food I ever had was in California. California. It was yeah. so fresh. Everything was so You're fresh right. You're food. right. Absolutely. Um, and Mexico, too. Um, I, I went there I probably been. the second time. I've been there twice now for Two my times. birthday. Yeah, so... Yeah. Nothing beats like that authentic, yeah, like, like taste culture. You too. know what I mean? It's like, not yeah. definitely not Taco Bell out there. So. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm not definitely even nothing like Taco that Bell. out there. Yeah, it's it's nothing sure. like that authentic yeah. taste. So yeah. yeah. So what what would you say is your favorite foods to get like in some place like Mexico? Because that's I I wanted to go to Cabo and I had set yeah, up some stuff through like Hilton mm-hmm. to get like a few days for like super cheap, and then mm-hmm. the pandemic hit and I never followed up with it. And, yeah. Um, 
Like, what is it like? Like, where did you go? And then, like, what what foods would you recommend? Because we definitely. do do food over here, too. So. Yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> yeah. Um, so I went to Cancun. Mm -hmm. I've been twice now. I love Cancun. I think it's beautiful out there. Yeah, I've I heard. I think Mex Mexico is a beautiful place. Right, right. Um, they have so many, like, hidden treasures out there. Right, for sure. Um, I think, like, some of the best food I have, me and my mom and my friend, a friend of mine, Kim, mm -hmm. we went to this excursion. It was, like, in the middle of the jungle. Right. It's crazy. In the middle of the jungle. And it was, like, this whole yeah. adventure, zip lining thing. And then afterwards, we had lunch. And, like, um, it was something as simple as chicken tacos, I think. Yeah. But they were so good. I'm so fresh. It's something that simple. the chicken out right there. I know. <laughs> you know it was just yeah. so good. It had so much <laughs> flavor. And it was mm -hmm. just, you know, like. Yeah. That was probably the best thing I ate that whole trip. Yeah, that sounded like a whole vibe and excursion. Like, mm -hmm. you know, I've done something similar like that. I, w I went to um, Costa Rica once oh. and we were, um, thank God nobody died because everybody was turned up and they were flipping over thank on the God. ATVs and we were like on the wow. mountain and stuff. I'm like, wow, yo, y'all wow. are wild. And they, we almost, they almost made us not go because mm -hmm. it happened before we even took off somebody. Yeah, that can be dangerous. So basically, I, I've, I've been be on watching you. Kevin, man. Yeah, like, <laughs> yeah. It, it can be yeah. dangerous. Yeah, and then and then we were kind of like what you said, like, we went to like a waterfall and, you know oh, what yeah. I'm saying? Mm -hmm. we, I didn't even know what we were getting into. And then mm -hmm. we were just riding through the mountains and then there was like this cliff and you see all this land and vegetation and then there was oh, like yeah. a chef and it was just open and we, like you said, we had like some basic chicken and yeah. foods and vegetables so and it was good. just... Um, so healthy and, and like you said in California what I notice is when I go out there too yeah when I eat here or at least in Virginia on the East Coast mm. I'm feeling heavy or tired yeah. and all of yeah. that but like when I go to these exotic places and get fresh right it just um it's different it gives you energy and, and I'm big mm. on talking about like because my wife sometimes she's like I, I don't know if I eat or you know what I'm saying yeah. like, how do you not <laughs> And I'm like, even if you don't want to, just to stay healthy and take right. care of your body, you got to look at your body like a plant and right, exactly. feed it and, and give it water. Like, I got, I'm at the offer you guys. <laughs> but, you know, I, I stay with water. Like, I'll go through these packs of Deer Park or whatever. Mm -hmm. And and if I run out of that, I'll put the Brita on and I'll just drink water. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And Nothing's better than that. My wife... I know she be watching. She jokes me all the time. Yeah. She like, we can be in a five star place and mm -hmm. they ask you what you want to drink. I'll be like, water. Water, you know right? What I'm and if I <laughs> want to get fancy, I'll be like, let me get some um, Perrier. Right. <laughs> you right. know what I'm saying? Or or some Voss, you know what I'm saying? But mm -hmm. um, I like just like hearing, hearing your story and just tying everything together from. Um, mm -hmm. The confidence, um, oh, you know, yeah. just the experience and building, and then the the work regimen and, and mm -hmm. taking care of yourself because without the health, none of this matters. You can't reap your um, your benefits or your rewards, and um, just the leisure of, of traveling and seeing exactly. things, and that that um it ties into everything that we do because like right. I feel like whenever I go somewhere and I come back home mm -hmm. I got like this charge of this type of energy right. or like I can't really explain it but it mm -hmm. just makes you feel motivated and and it feels almost like a new year you know how right. the new year is right. like new year new me okay. when you when you get these life experiences um that's what it does for you so mm -hmm. you know with just bringing this all to full circle and mm -hmm. you taking the opportunity to work with go get it like i really appreciate it because this is Thank the type you. of stuff that i want to do with networking with us and just yeah. empowering each other and um of course we i haven't talked too much about it but i'm i'm working with someone and um we're we're trying to put together a network you know what i'm saying a network of oh. collective of us so that we can touch on finances like you said we can touch on yeah, health we can talk really on different nice. arenas and things that are needed to be you know, successful in life, even yeah. real estate and, you know, all of these things. And since we're here, it sounds like that's the type of path that you're on. And I would just like to, Definitely, um, yeah. we haven't got it set in stone, but I would love to see you, you know, come up there and then maybe be an advocate or speak or, course, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just be a part of this because you're doing something yeah. and you took a chance with me and I took a chance with you. And I just mm -hmm. I find like stuff like that just beautiful because there's so many people who have a certain type of mentality or mm -hmm. maybe they've gone through certain circumstances where they mm -hmm. don't push the envelope or, right. you know what I'm saying? It's really that you can do what you want to do. And, oh, yeah. and I'm big 
to every time that I come in front of you guys and speak that mm -hmm. you need to jot down what you want to do. You know, the right. first thing is to just write it down and see it. And I was just talking to my sister mm -hmm. who two vlogs ago, I, I, she invited me to a company party mm -hmm. and I felt so inspired and her company, she's always winning stuff and, right. and she's always getting bonuses because she works so hard, but she travels a lot and she's about to nice. travel for a few weeks. Mm -hmm. and do her thing and like I said get those experiences and maybe have a place to live at you know and that's inspired me yeah so um people like her you and others or any of y'all that are you know that are doing um what you want to do or something that makes you happy or inspires others I encourage y'all to tap in and and just follow go get it across the board and I'm gonna put that in the description because we really want to bring us together because You'll see it maybe with celebrities and stuff, but when you mm -hmm. do it from the level that we are at and we can really touch the common people right. and then make it there, I really believe that we can take things to the next level Definitely. and just, you know, I really want to see everything like our communities and even banking and stuff like that. So, yeah, um, you gotta think I just think so many thoughts and stuff and um, just get in front of everybody and just be encouraging and I just want to say that you have been encouraging um to me and the fact that you know we come from around the same yeah. area and life has so many different pulls at us uh -huh. that who would have thought that you know you would be modeling something of Your mine clothing line, right? right or even sitting <laughs> here on my regular couch right. <laughs> on YouTube you know what I'm saying so uh -huh. I appreciate that mm -hmm. and before we go I just wanted to give you you know the floor to say Anything else or any shout outs or, you know, something that you want the people to know about you or in the closing? Yeah. Um, definitely shout out to Bell, my photographer. Um, follow him on Instagram. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to probably like it. Visual <laughs> access <laughs> photography. That's it, yeah. Um, for my sure. makeup artist, Tori. I'm so grateful for her because she's the one that puts me together most yeah. of the time. Yeah. Um, other than that, I mean, I just feel like, like, anyone that's out there like doubting themselves you know right. what i mean yeah. or like too afraid to take that step forward like just do it life is short right life is just short you never know where it's going to take you that's you it. know i never thought i'd be on a magazine but there i am all right you on there <laughs> so you that just never know yourself. you never yeah. know what anything can turn into what type of opportunities mm -hmm. can be placed in front of you so definitely mm -hmm. definitely believe in yourself and as always you already know what it is Let's get it, go get it. Gia. 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 Gia.